Welcome to CA Network Flow Analysis. In this video, we will learn how we can integrate NFA with LDAP. Take a remote session to CA Network Flow Analysis NFA console server. Go to the path where your NFA got installed and navigate to Portal SSO bin. Double click on ssoconfig.exe to open SSO settings. Here you got two options CAPC and CNFA. Enter 2 to select CNFA, 1 to enter LDAP authentication. Two for local override. Here you have 1 to 13 values. We are going to fill the required values, minimum required values for LDAP authentication. Enter 1 for connection user. Enter U to update the present value. I am going to use the default values, which is 0. If you enter 0, it will read the username from the prompt. for connection password you to update you can use one in curly braces three for search domain Four to enter such string. I would use the default value. Five to enter substring. This is for search scope. User bind and encryption are not needed. We are going to enter account user. It should be Sam account name. Ninth here you are going to enter user default clone this user should be present in nfa already so that the authenticated users will be cloned against this value we have entered all the required fields for ldap now we would go back and try to test this ldap settings we will Test with option 5. We will enter valid LDAP user and check if it would get authenticated. There is an error. Bind to the directory field. Login failure. Seems like our LDAP settings are wrong. So I would revisit my LDAP settings. Seems like my username is not in correct format. I am trying to edit that. Now again, I will go back and try to test the settings. Seems like my password is incorrect. I am going to check the settings once again. to enter the password once again no 
okay now again b two times to go back file to test will cap settings Now the clone it success. You can try to log in with LDAP user onto NFA web console and check if it's working. It got logged in properly. You can see the username over here. For additional information regarding CNFA, you can visit product documentation, CA communities, and CA learning paths. Thank you for watching this video.